Hi, welcome to WeldNerd. Today we're going to be talking about programming the AC frequency and balance in the Dynasty 280 and 210DX. Alright, so this is how you're going to make your balance and frequency adjustments when you're welding in AC, welding on aluminum. First you're obviously going to be in AC, uh, then you're going to come over to the column on the far right, you press the button once, obviously that takes us out of our main panel amperage. Uh, balance, we have a range of 99% electronegative, which is infrequently used, down to 50%. So this would be a balanced wave like you would see on uh, old school mag amp type machines. If we go any further left, we get ball, which is uh, uh, 25 or 30% electrode negative, so mostly electrode positive for, for the purposes of balling your electrode if your application requires it. But pro set's going to be 75%. It's a very good balance of uh, arc stability and etching. Hit the button one more time, we get frequency. We can take that down from 20 hertz all the way up to 400 hertz. Pro set being 120 hertz, which is good in the vast majority of situations. Um, up in that 400 hertz, basically anything over about 200 hertz is mostly going to be valuable for very thin material, of course. Um, now, if we want to get out of this menu, just like everything else, go ahead and press the A for amperage, and we're back to our panel amperage. That's it. So I just wanted to take a second and let you guys know that we're going to get a lot deeper into this. Uh, we're going to do some different videos. Obviously, we don't have time in a very short focus video like this to really dive into the complexity of AC TIG controls. So we're going to do at least four more videos. Uh, balance, frequency, pulsing, independent amplitude, probably something else. I might get more of an opportunity to do some more uh, weatherman stuff like this. We'll see. Um, but. Thank you very much for watching and uh, please stay tuned.